given in the United States of America. We just watched a total misogynist get inaugurated yesterday. But every step forward, every victory, whether it's been against sexism, or racism, or homophobia, or injustice, in the United States has been hard fought and hard won. We know who Trump is. We've heard his hate, his, and his reckless plans, and they threaten the safety, and the health, and the prosperity of every American. But we know who Californians are too. Prop 187 was not the end of immigrant rights in California. Prop 187 was a spur to a movement to protect immigrant rights in California. And Prop 8 was not the end of marriage equality here. It was the spur to a movement to make sure that marriage equality would be the law of the land. So we have to make sure that this election does not take us back to a time when women were second-class citizens. It has to be the spur to a movement that says 2016 can never happen again. Mr. Trump will never represent the majority of the people in this square. But he will also never represent the majority of Americans. So we have to make sure that we do not compromise on the safety, the health, and the dignity of our people. We have to make sure we do not compromise on a woman's right to choose. <laughs> activism, your activism is patriotism. We are the patriots. And people across America today are lifting up their voices with us. And because we've come together, because we will not be silent, the people in this square and the people like us around the United States of America can be the greatest force for good on the face of the earth. So let me say, rock on Oakland.